Okay, so uh, welcome back everyone to my video. We continue to uh, another video. Okay, so uh, we already configured successfully. Uh, we land on this magnetic router. And now we want to uh, configure uh, management IP address for this uh, magnetic router. So after that, we can uh, monitor this magnetic using this uh, Zabbix server, okay? So the IP address for this one, maybe I can say, uh, because this one, 202, 203, and this will be 204. Okay. Okay, so this is uh, our plan and uh, we want to assign this IP on this magnetic switch and we uh, add this magnetic to our Zabbix server here, okay? So let's uh, get our wind box, okay? We try to connect. Okay, so now we connect back to our magnetic router, uh, magnetic switch here. Uh, okay, interface. So now uh, we we want to create uh, this uh, interface VLAN for okay our VLAN two hundred. VLAN ID 200 Okay um, This one we need to uh, uh, assign on our bridge here Okay Apply Okay Okay So now we have our VLAN 200 Okay so This is our interface VLAN 200 let's go close this one and then we go to ip address we 200.4 interface vlan 200 okay we already assigned this uh, ip address to our uh, vlan 200 we go to ip route we add the default route to our call switch here uh, 200.254 okay so 192.168.200.254 okay apply okay okay so now done we try to check our connection thing one and two one six eight two hundred dot two five four okay uh, not yet okay so we need to go back to our bridge here okay bridge here we need to add our Um, we need to add our VLAN. Okay, VLAN two hundred. Apply this one two hundred. Okay, apply. We go to VLAN here. Uh, this is a. Uh, Previously, we can see VLAN 20 and VLAN 30. So now we can see another uh, VLAN 200. We try to uh, add this one, VLAN 200. Uh, our type port, this one, and then uh, our bridge, okay. Apply, okay. 
after we uh, create our VLAN interface and then we assign the VLAN to this uh, uh, VLAN ID to this uh, bridge we try to go back and try to ping again okay so now we can uh, we can ping to our server let try to ping to this Zabbix server we cannot ping to Zabbix server okay so why we cannot ping let me check my let me refresh okay can let me okay uh, ping one and two one six eight two hundred dot four okay actually we can ping uh, to to our Mikrotik here from our Zabbik to Mikrotik here okay so now we go to this uh, window client and we try to add our host okay so before we add our host we need to enable the SNMP this one uh, we, we require SNMP in order to add into our Zabbik here okay so we go to this uh, Microtech I close this one I close this one uh, we go to IP and then SNMP okay we enable so this one whatever information you uh, uh, provide you can provide your own information okay and then trap target this is our Zabbik server okay public trap version 1 okay and then community public you go to this one and then we enable on okay read access and write access okay we apply and then we apply okay so now we are on uh, this Zabbik we try to create one host uh, my micro tick sorry micro tick switch okay micro tick switch template okay template uh, network device okay if you not uh, see here uh, maybe the first time you can select on here you can choose template network device and then you have all the template here before we add the Cisco we have uh, select Cisco but now we are on Microtech so uh, we go down go down okay so Microtech uh, what is our model? I want to go back. Uh, Microtik CRS 328-24P for us. Okay. Microtik CRS 328-24. Okay, this one. This is our model of uh, our Microtik switch. So we select, we tick on this one and then we select host group. Host group, 
so before we have this call uh, Cisco network switch and call network so Microtech we not yet have maybe I can add to this group first after that we go to chain okay interface we need to select SNMP okay and then we tap in the IP address of uh, Microtech okay SNMP version 1 and then we copy this one okay we copy this one we go to here macro and we pass on this one uh, we tap in public okay we try to add okay so now we have a magnetic switch here wait for a moment it will uh, uh, take some time to uh, detect this uh, magnetic so I want to go to uh, data collection host group uh, I want to create uh, another host okay my grow take switch okay so now I go back to host my take switch I want to add into my grotech switch group here okay update okay so now we try to refresh okay so now we can see that uh, our Zabbix server can uh, detect uh, our magnetic switch and it so two graph and one issue what is the issue okay hi I see MP ping loss okay so because this is the first time uh, it detect this problem okay so after that the uh, okay you can see here ping loss okay everyone so i think this is uh, we come to our end of uh, this uh, lab practice i hope everyone uh, get more understand on how to add our network device using uh, snmp whatever device uh, you can uh, add by enable snmp and uh, my uh, the big server can monitor all those device uh, Thank you very much everyone that uh, watching my video until the end.